That's called a bad day right there, dude. Truck flipped right over on that son of a bitch. Holy fuck. That's right. No that. joke, daddy-o. Look at what? What are we looking at? That sign stopped. Oh, yeah. You see, all 16 cars are backed up on this road because of that truck being flipped over. No, it was right in the middle of the goddamn road. Talk about having a bad goddamn day. Holy fucking shit. Talk about having a bad day. And he ain't even got to the fucking good part yet. Stupid son of a bitch. Probably drinking and driving or something. Probably doing a video and driving is probably what happened. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> Look, Pigeon River again. We've crossed that fucking Pigeon River seven times now. That's the river we white water rafted the other day. Ah. Uh, what the fuck was I just thinking about? I forgot. Something important, I'm sure. Um, that truck being flipped over just fucking shocked me, actually, a little bit. I've never come through here. I wonder what that poor bastard was hauling. I'm sure now we'll have supply chain problems because of a truck flipped over in the middle of no man's land, North Carolina. Look at this guy. Hauls his own oxygen. Oh, it's a fish wagon. He's hauling fish. Isn't that nice? What do you haul? Oh, fish. I haul fish. What is it that now we have to fucking haul fish around? People understand fish can swim, right? You put them in water and they get to other parts of the water. Like now we gotta drive fish to different places and let them go. You know, I read. I. I got. I got a magazine. Let me turn this fucking thing around. So I bought some fucking shit to dye my goddamn pond at home to try to cut out on the weeds that are growing in the fucker. So I, I, it's a gallon jug. I order the gallon jug. It arrives. I open the gallon jug and inside the gallon jug is a fucking two ounce jug of the fucking shit that I ordered. So that's false advertising, step one. That used to be a no-no. So now the little bastards send me magazines on how to care for your pond, right? Do you know they have a whole page and a half on how to care for sick fish? How you care for a sick fish? Like, what do you do? Take the fucking fish's temperature? Wouldn't you have to catch the fucker to fucking take care for it? I'm, I'm sorry, but a hook in the fucker might not be good for a fish that's already sick. Oh, uh, well, I felt like shit today. Then I woke up with a fucking hook through my cheek, and now I really feel bad. Yeah, I think you're better off leaving a sick fish. I've never heard of caring for a sick fish. It's just fucking ridiculous. And again, I wonder if you go to the veterinarian, maybe there's a bunch of people walking in with sick fish. I don't know. What the fuck do I know? So anyways, flipped over truck on I-40. They're on the westbound side though. So it really didn't affect us that much, which just surprises me. Normally that's the kind of shit that ruins my day. Not to mention the asshole that's flipped over over there, I'm sure. His day's not going so well either, but. Oh well, teach you to fucking drive and do videos, won't I? Fucking idiots. All right, I'm gone.